Just wanted to show a, a quick comparison between a 5.56 round that you'd see mostly from a AR-15 versus a 30-odd-6 uh, hunting round that you'd you know, see very commonly in a bolt-action rifle. Um, your 5.56 round traditionally is going to be a 55-grain bullet. It's going to be a full metal jacket. That's so, you know, you have no trouble in feeding. Uh, it's going to feed reliably, things like that, in that semi-automatic um, action that you'd see in an AR-15. Um, both these rounds are going to, you know, launch a projectile in the neighborhood of 3,000 feet per second, maybe slightly more than 3,000, maybe slightly less than 3,000. Um, with a 30-odd-6, this has become a traditional hunting round. It started as a military cartridge, um, but it's become a very common hunting round. Um, you're going to see an exposed lead at the tip. Um, this is so the bullet will expand on impact, like you would see, you know, the traditional mushroom. Um, you know, it's designed to kill your game quickly and efficiently. Uh, this is designed to, you know, reliably feed through your, your semi-automatic action. Um, but we're talking about a 150 grain bullet versus a 55 grain bullet. And those are probably the most common you're going to see for these two uh, cartridges. Um, but that's just kind of a, a comparison between the two, you know, both are designed, you know, to do their job effectively. Um, but this is what you're going to see in your very common traditional 30 odd six hunting round that exposed lead 150 grain bullet. Um, like I said, that's going to ha have that mushroom on impact and it's designed to deliver a lot of energy and a lot of shock to the target. Um, you know, something like this, that 5.56, five, uh, the 55 grain bullet, moving a little bit faster. It's going to have a lot more penetration, maybe a lot less tissue damage. Um, but you're going to get a lot more penetration with that lighter, faster round. Um, but just kind of a comparison of the of the two. You get a, a you know, look side by side at, you know, and you can probably just tell by the lethality of it. But there's your 30-odd-6 and there's your 5.56. Five, five,